Hi students, welcome to our innovation. In the name channel, 7th Standard English, Term 3, Unit 2, Prose, A Story of Self-Sacrifice and Bravery. Prose, or a book evaluation, we will learn panna poorong. Vanga video klaar poolaan. The process about uh, Neeraja Bahot who was a flight attender and during when she was an attender in the flight PAM and flight 73 there were 360 passengers on the board and the flight was hijacked. It is hijacked by the terrorist and she saved the passengers who were traveling in the flight. So during this hijack she sacrificed her own life for the passengers for the people and by this she was rewarded by the three governments that is India, Pakistan and the American governments they honored her. So this was explained in this uh, prose children. Now let us we see the book evaluation. Fill in the blanks. The terrorist attacked the Neeraja to collect the passport of the passengers because so the terrorist in Apananga they were collecting the passport. They need the passport of the passengers. To identify the Americans on the board. So they are traffic uh, cornering the Americans. They want only the American passengers. So other identify the passport ketanga. So you have to write the answer. To identify the Americans on board. Second one, Neeraja passed on the warning in a code to the pilots because she wanted to alert them. So once the Neeraja about the hijacking, she was corner and she was warning the pilots. So why to alert them? Okay, you have to write the answer. She wanted to alert them. Third one, Neeraja left into action when she noticed there was a cause on the board so there was a confusion so it means the terrorists they are making some cause but she was noticed all this so you have you had to write in the fill in the blanks noticed there was a cause on the board next neeraja had a sore marriage due due to pressurizing dowry demand so because of that her marriage life was not good okay so pressurizing dowry demands this is the answer think and write i will die but not run away justify the saying of neeraja so these words this sentence is said by neeraja we have to justify it page number 106 you can find the answer here children i will die but not run away so these words are said this is said by the mm -hmm, younger lady that is neeraja this was uh, what young neeraja told her mother when they had discussed the sensitive situation of a hypothetical hijack you have to mark up to here then one day her mother had picked this topic so in the mari or topic in the mari nadanda enna agum apdi neeraja katta kekkum bodu her mother was advising to move from that place to save her life, her own life is saved by her mother. See, one day her mother had picked this topic and told Neeraja that she must save herself in case a hijack ever took place on a Pam Am flight. The airlines that Neeraja was working for, to this Neeraja had asked her mother to never think this way. So, Neeraja had told her to never think this way. So, Neeraja had told her to never she was determined to not be a coward in such a situation and she lived up to her word. So, avanga appove Neeraja in the mari or situation vanda na and the mari kola thanama irka maata I will give up even my life a print avanga solli irka anga avanga sonna mari e da nadand irka ok. So, you have to mark from here till here and you can start from here and end of this ok. This is the first answer. Why did the government of India, America and Pakistan honor Neeraja? Page number 109, Neeraja's act of bravery. So Neeraja oda and the tunichalilaya bravery and was acknowledged and rewarded by the 
Indian, Pakistan and American government. This is the second answer. Third question, if you are a flight attendant, how will you deal with the hijackers? So this is an own question children, you have to write by your own words. Now here, Neeraja, the heroine, the hijack heroine, her life. So among a life, there are two points. So what she had done, you had to write to her achievements. Okay, she won the awards. Among her, she was an advertiser. She is a she was a model and also as a flight attender. And her achievements, she won the various rewards, isn't it? That also you can write here. Now let us see the vocabulary. See here the words are given. You have to fill the appropriate words for this fill ups. You must present the boarding pass at the gate. It might be bumpy ride because we are flying through a storm. If you need anything just press the call light. The captain and the co-pilot sit in the cockpit. Gate 3B is down this hall and to your right. We will be landing in Chennai in approximately 10 minutes. The plane almost missed the runway because it was such a bad storm. We are next in line to take off on this runway. That was a very smooth touchdown. This turbulence should only last a few minutes. So these are the answers. These are related to the airlines. Okay. Match the following is given here children. Phrasal verbs are here and their meanings are there. Fight or flight. That is to defend oneself or to run away. Put to flight. To cause someone to flee. Take flight. To flee or run away. Flight of fancy. An imaginative but unrealistic idea. Have a nice flight. Enjoy your flight. In full flight, escaping as rapidly as possible. Top flight among the best of a particular group. So, page number 114, these are anagram. That is, an anagram is a word or a phrase formed by rearranging the letters of a different word or phrase, typically using all original letters exactly one. Seat east. So, the same letters will be there, but you will get a different word. Okay, that is uh, called as an anagram. See, see, example, they had given seat, east, alert, altar. Now, the past tense of leap is leapt. But using the same letters, something to serve food on, that is plate. So, leapt la pathing na, they spelling the arkum plate. We will change it and write it as plate. Okay, so this will be very easy and interesting one for you children. A place to grow flowers that is garden. Something to be careful of it is danger. Then another word for under is blow, below. A part of your arm is elbow. Try to hear that is listen. Another word for quiet is silent. Another word for gift is present. A large snake or a dragon is called serpent. Minutes has that is time. A thing on a list is item. An organ that pumps blood, heart. The earth we live on is earth. Something used to water plants, hose. A thing you put on your foot is shoe. So these are the answers. That's right children. Now we have completed this prose book evaluation. Kandipen the video ongloku useful arukun nanikara. Nama our innovation channel hai idu varikun nenga subscribe panna mandhengna. Subscribe pannikonga. Like, comment, share the our innovation channel. Thanks for watching our video. Thank you. Have a nice day.